Good evening, this is Nyla Learn to Trade the Market. Wanted to talk about the British pound tonight, and we can see there is a giant level there at 1.7620. We had a pin bar form uh, around about 48 hours ago. You can see the high there at 176.20, and then a giant pin bar, even though it did close positive on the day. Uh, off this bottom here at 170 moved up to 176.20 the session sold off here you can just see that giant uh, pin bar setup and the strategy uh, is going with the trend so we're going to take that trade and there was a retrace back up to actually test those highs we've had now two pin bars and the market's selling off so I guess the question I've been getting is um, you know how do I trade it well I took the first signal there was a pin bar so I just shorted the first retracement back up which is the 50 to 55 percent range of that first candle the entry was uh, around there 175 20 ish in that area there and, and I guess the question is well if I missed it and I saw this set up now would I take it whilst I can not answer that directly you know there's nothing wrong with the setup there is two pin bars it's in the direction of the trend the market's selling off you know the bias is obviously short here for the professional traders because the market is falling in line with the trend and price action agrees if we want to take it one step further we can also see confluence of this horizontal level through here at 176 which was a prior swing high you can see there was some tails on these candles through here so 176 is obviously very important and the market is trapped below it so Knowing that, you would have to think that these lows down here are the, the downside support target, at least near 168. And whilst that isn't a uh, trade setup, so, you know, it lets you know where the market's going. So all you got to do is find that previous low market on your chart. And that's your first reference for a, a profit target or at least um, where the market's going to stall out. I actually traded that pin bar as it was, entered in the 75s, and I got out in the 71s overnight. So, you know, it was a 3 to 1 risk reward trade for me. If you're looking to get into the setup um, as it happens live, you've got to kind of be a bit savvy with your stop. So, if you're entering a 173 now, where's your stop? It's got to probably be over 200 points, which is pretty wide. So, you'd probably have to look for more of an intraday approach so that you can have your stop that little bit tighter. So there you have the uh, pin bar signals. We're going to follow that one and see where the market goes. And uh, I'll recap it in a few days and we'll see how the market fared. This is just another quick reminder to everyone that I have launched my Forex trading course. Access it by clicking trading course at the top right hand side of the learn to trade the market.com website. In that uh, page, you'll see details and videos of the course, course content, synopsis, etc. Down the bottom we have two options. There's a outright one payment of 397 US dollars. I'm pretty sure that is a fair price based on the fact that most people do trade uh, and risk more than that on a trade. So if you can't afford the course, probably uh, shouldn't be trading in my opinion. Uh, and the second uh, option is three payments of 133 US dollars just to make it easier. Some of those guys are still on paper accounts and learning that don't want to commit to the full amount in one go. All right. So just uh, to recap, it's the right hand side of the page there, trading course. You can obviously email me any questions you've got regarding the content before you buy if you're not sure. Alright, we will see you next time. Take care.